so the other day, well, the last few weeks actually, I've been on the hunt for a new Oracle deck. And my budget's been kind of low, but I've really wanted to get a new one. And so I went on eBay, I was looking around, and I found one for one that was in my price range. So I sent the lady a message asking her how good of conditions they were and all that stuff because I know when they come off eBay, they're not always going to be in the best of shape. And when she sent me a message back, it was kind of cryptid. So I think she was like, um, like out of the country. It didn't read English. It was like she was trying to talk English, but it wasn't coming out that way. So I really couldn't quite understand what the message was. But I looked at the ladies' reviews and all this and all that, and I found this deck that I'm going to do a quick review on. I found it for under $9, free shipping. I think I just got lucky, but that happens when you're on eBay. And this, I received it in the mail today. This is the deck that I picked up. The Heart of the Fairy Oracle. And at first, when I first opened this up, I was like, oh no, because the packaging uh, was a little bit ruined. So I was like, oh no. I was, I was kind of worried until I opened it up. And I don't know if anybody or any of you have this deck, but this is the first time I have ever, ever received an Oracle deck that had a hard back book. It's hardback. It's the first time I've ever seen one in hardback. Just like any of the or any of the other ones that you would get normally have paperback. This one's hardback. So I was extremely excited about that. And looking at this book, it looks in pristine condition. Pristine. There's nothing wrong with this book. I opened it up, and I've already taken, there was a, there was one of those sleeves around the, the cards, and um, I counted them, all the cards were here, and the cards are also in pristine condition. So I think the only th reason that they bumped this price down, because these normally sell for $25 in the U.S., and I think the only reason that they bumped down the price on these was because of the cover and the inside. So I was extremely, extremely happy to see that these cards and the book was in excellent condition. So I'll show you the book again. The Heart of the Fairy Oracle by Brian and Wendy Froud. The pictures of these, I've done been through the cards. I have not used them yet. But I think I'm going to start working with them for a little bit because the cards are just beautiful. Um, there are 67, 60, 5, 6, 7. There's 65 cards, but then you get three of these extra ones that I'll show you here in a little bit. But this is going to be a really... Um, I'm going to go through every one of the cards so you can see what they look like. Um... And then, yeah, just check them out on, I, like I said, I found these on eBay, The Heart of the Fairy Oracle, and um, I, th I think I got a pretty good deal on these cards. So these are going to be in um, numerical order, because they're just how they came to me. But I'll go through these kind of fast, because there are, you know, 65 cards, so I'll go through them kind of fast, so this video isn't too terribly long. I'm sorry about the glare.
when I was going through these earlier, I actually did find a couple of cards that were kind of funny. And I haven't looked them up yet to find out what they actually mean. But they're quite humorous to me. One in particular. <laughs> we still have a little bit to go yet before we get to that card. I love this next card. It's so adorable. I love this next card. Love it. If you hear kids in the background, school just school bus just let the kids out. Look at this one. Look at her face. Neener, neener, neener. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> I like this card too. These cards have a very good energy to them. They're not dark. I was afraid they were going to be a little bit dark. But um, they're actually not. Okay, this next card is the one that just cracks me up. <laughs> that is so funny. <laughs> and I'm curious to know what this card means. That's another interesting one. <laughs> this this card creeps me out. I'll show you why. See the face that way? Oh, you see it that way? Two faces. This one creeps me out. Sorry, I thought I heard something. I hear stuff in my house all the time. Especially when I don't have anything going. No TV, no fan, no nothing. It's just quiet. So that was the last card. Then you get three of these cards. And I believe they're duplicates of already car of cards that are that I've already shown you. Um, so I'm not really sure why they would throw these in unless they're just used for picture purposes. I don't know, but you got this one. Now there's like I said, there's no number, no name, no meaning, no no nothing. And then there's this one. And then there's this one. And all the back of the cards look like this. They're pretty good size. About the size of your hand. So all in all, I am very, very happy with this Oracle deck. Um, I'm going to sleep with it a couple of times. And then um, I might come on here and maybe do a... Um, uh, maybe, do, maybe I'll do a... Um, a weekly reading and just to test these out um, I will eventually start offering to do some tarot readings or, or oracle readings I don't really do tarot but I'm always on the lookout for good oracle decks so if you have any suggestions 
or um, anything of that matter when it comes to Oracle decks, please leave me a message or leave me a comment and I'll look into them. Um, I have another Oracle deck review coming up in a day or two and um, that one is going to be over the Gaia Oracle. Um, so yeah, if you know of any Oracle decks that are awesome to have or unique, I love unique Oracle decks. I've seen a few that are actually round. The, car the, 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 the cards themselves are round and I just think that's so unique and pretty awesome. Um, I think I had seen um, Willow do a video on either an Oracle deck or a Terra deck that she has that they're round. I just thought that was so cool. So yeah, if you know of any Oracle decks that you highly recommend, leave me a message in the comments and I'll check into it. Maybe even um, purchase them and do a review on them. So yeah. Um, if you want to know any more about these cards, just contact me, leave me a message, and I will answer back what I can. So yeah, this again is <clears throat> the Heart of the Fairy Oracle number one. So yeah, until next time guys, blessings.